day. Um, my name is Mrs. De Beer and I teach visual arts at Glenwood High School. It has been an honor for me to have been able to do this for so long. Um, I'm teaching highly motivated boys and sometimes they are also um, great sportsmen, but they have these amazing talents in the fields of art. Art and um, visual arts is chosen at the end of the grade nine here as a choice subject and the boys learn the skills in drawing and painting, sculpture, or all sorts in which they then pursue uh, their specific style and technique till the end of their matric year. And many of the boys go into architecture after school, into visual arts and careers such as um, design, photography, etc. It is a very satisfying and rewarding subject. It is hard work though. It doesn't come easy. The boys will have to put the hours into it, the time into it, but in the end, it is a very, very satisfying, rewarding subject. Thank you. I wish the boys all the best of luck for the end of this year, which was a very, very, very hard year for all the metrics and for the visual art course as well. And to be able to complete the metric year successfully. Thank you very much. My name is Jesus Bia, we're 12 visual artists. In grade eight, I found out I had a passion for art and I was very talented. So I decided why not in grade 10, pick it up as a choice subject and grind it out. So as I chose it, I realized that I was a great graphic artist, which means that I use pencil, I draw portraits, and I'm very talented at that. So I see art as a freedom of expression. I feel liberated when I go to the art classroom. It feels more of an excursion than an art lesson, really. So after matric, I decided that I want to be a graphic artist in an, in an university I want to go to. And it has, it has grown me a lot as a person, and I wish to carry on with it. Thank you.